Today, a quick tutorial on how to refine the edge of something in Photoshop after you've cut it out. If you want to get a perfect edge in Photoshop, tune in for today's tutorial. What is up people, welcome back to Tutorial Graphics, the home of graphic design content right here on YouTube. I'm actually on vacation this week and I've needed a break for a long time. So this is one of the pre-recorded videos that I've made and next week I'm going to go back to normal with my regular uploads. First, let's actually make the cutout of our focal point and you can bring up the layers panel by pressing F7 on your keyboard. You then need to click the layer icon to unlock it. There are many different ways to cut out something from an image in Photoshop and one way is to use the pen tool to draw around it but today I'm going to quickly show you it with the quick selection tool. The trick or the technique that will perfectly smoothen it is going to be coming very soon in the video but first we need to cut out the image. With the quick selection tool all you need to do is click in the area that you want to cut out and then you can hold down the alt option key to redraw in an area that you want to keep. Experiment with different sizes of the brush to have differing levels of detail on the selections that you're making. But just remember, holding down the Alt Option key will actually draw back in areas. I actually have the background selected right now, but for this technique I want to have the model selected. So we can inverse the selection like so. Now, add a layer mask by clicking the layer mask icon at the bottom of the layers panel. As you can see, the edge is really rough on my model, but we're going to fix that right now. With the mask thumbnail selected in the layers window, head up to select and then select unmask. This is where the magic happens and you can actually move the shift edge down and then take some time to play around the other settings too. Whilst you're doing that, watch the changes in real time on your image. You will inevitably end up with a very soft and a natural looking edge and this is the ideal outcome for today's video and the technique on how to get a perfect edge. If you enjoyed or you found today's video useful, drop a like and a comment right down below and also don't forget to subscribe to Satoru Graphics if you haven't done already. Make sure you have a great day and until next time, design your future today. Peace.